Let's head just a bit north now of Kalamazoo to where police are searching the suspect's home for us this morning on Douglas Avenue. That's right, and 24 News Day's Coco McAvoy has spent the morning out there talking with authorities. She's monitoring that situation for us. So Coco, what are you seeing now? Good morning. Since I spoke to you at 730, I checked in with a neighbor out here on scene and he says he always thought Jason Dalton was a normal guy, says he always saw him outside here, outside of his house with his family. And he's obviously just as shocked and terrified as everyone else after this terrible tragedy. But you'll hear from him in just a minute. I want to get back to what's going out here on scene. Officers are still actively searching this home. It's located in a rural area on Douglas and E Avenue West. This is northwest of Kalamazoo and officers have been taking pictures inside of the home and after being inside of the house for nearly two hours, officers have started canvassing the outside and as you heard at a news conference, they are looking for anything that might give them a better idea as to why Dalton would commit this terrible act of violence. Again, we know eight people were shot, six of them are dead and two people are injured and now I want to get you back to that sound that we just got with the neighbor. So close, you know, I, I just, I don't know, I'm, it just, it's coming out here, it's scary, you know, you got stuff going on downtown, and then you come out here, it's, you know, your house supposed to be your safe spot, and is it looking now, nowhere safe. And we've been working to learn more information about Dalton. We did dig into his criminal background, and we know that he does not have a criminal history in Michigan or in Indiana. We do know, again, that he is in police custody, and officers say that multiple agencies are questioning him right now, trying to learn more information, maybe even a motive as to why all of this happened. We'll, of course, stay out here all morning long, and we'll be checking in with authorities to find out what they find out here. Back to you.